Most High be praised, magnified, and esteemed. We will begin with the chapter for this week, and it is in Psalms 33. Let us begin. Verse 1. Rejoice in the Most High, O you righteous. Praise is comely for the upright. Verse 2. Praise the Most High with harp. Sing unto him with psaltery and an instrument of ten strings. Verse 3. Sing unto him a new song, play skillfully with a loud voice. Verse 4. For the word of the Most High is right, and all his works are done in truth. Verse 5. He loves righteousness and judgment. The earth is full of the goodness of the Most High. Verse 6. By the word of the Most High were the heavens made, and all the host of them by the breath of his mouth. Verse 7. He gathers the waters of the sea together as in heap. He lays up the depth in storehouses. Verse 8. Let all the earth fear the Most High. Let all the inhabitants of the world stand in awe of him. Verse 9. For he spoke and it was done. He commanded and it stood. Verse 10. The Most High brings the counsel of the heathen to naught. He makes the devices of the people of none effect. Verse 11. The counsel of the Most High stands forever. The thoughts of his heart to all generations. Verse 12. Blessed is the nation whose power is the Most High Yah, the people who he has chosen for his own inheritance. Verse 13, the Most High looks from heaven, he beholds all the sons of men. Verse 14, from the place of his habitation, he looks up, he looks upon all the inhabitants of the earth. Let's read verse 14 again. Verse 14, from the place of his habitation, he looks upon all the inhabitants of the earth. Verse 15, he fashions their hearts alike. He considers all their works. Verse 16, for, verse 16, there is no king saved by the multitude of an host. A mighty man is not delivered by much strength. Verse 17, a horse is a vain thing for safety. Neither shall he deliver any by his great strength. Verse 19, the eye of the Most High is upon them that fear him, upon them that hope in his mercy. Verse 19, to deliver their soul from death and to keep them alive in famine. Verse 20, our soul waits for the Most High. He is our help and our shield. Verse 21, for our heart shall rejoice in him because we have trusted in his holy name. Verse 22, let your mercy, O Yah, be upon us according as we hope in you. That will conclude the reading of Psalms 33 for the chapter of the week.